Burke. Been a while. Lincoln Clay. Jesus Christ on the cross. Now I've seen everything. I heard you were dead. Been hearing that a lot. What the fuck do you want? Came here to make you a business proposition. Is that so? I'm going after Marcano, his brothers, anyone else that's associated with him. You want my help? The way I see it, once we deal with Barbieri, you get Point Vidun back. After that, we can discuss what happens to the rest of the city. No, fuck off. You got bald and chalky bastard once already. Look where I got me. From where I'm standing, I'm not seeing much of a difference between then and now. You listen that, you listen to God, you fuck. <laughs> Danny was so buttoned up, the coroner wouldn't let me get a last look. Anyone's killing that fucking Marcano. That's me. Unless Marcano's hanging around one of these dive bars, I don't think he has too much to worry about. Yeah, go fuck yourself. You got more stones in the lakes of you there are fucking off. A fucking ingrat. Coming to your question, me. You and your kind, you are caught down wrong at the first sign of trouble. You always have, you always will. Stone, so I figured we'd take a little ride. See who cracks first, the Chalky or the Mick. Give it a rest before you get the peelers all horned up for us. Pull over here. Nah, get the fuck out of my ride. Give me time to sober up, then come see me. I think we can work something out. So soon, then. Tell me about Barbieri. Barbieri? Well, he's a right fucking cunt. I can tell you that much. You know what I'm asking, Burke. Give me something I can use. Barbieri's running Splow out of the Sweetwater Distillery. Splow. Panther's piss. White mule. Alley gin. Potchain, moonshine, you ignorant fuck. Christ, what kind of booze you people drink over there in Darkyville? Kind that's not called painter's piss. <laughs> Boy, you ain't lived. Set the whole thing up myself. Then that gunny fuck comes in and takes it from me. Smashes me knee all to hell. barbieri has gonna suffer. You hear? Days. Slow. What else has he got besides the distillery? I run is that old Robert O. Slaughterhouse. He's doing more in there than cutting a lean ribe. Drags in there. That's the end there. I'll do the heavy lifting on this, Burke. Uh -huh. But once Barbieri's dead, I'm counting on you to step up. Oh, I'll do more than step up. I'll either be running this whole damn town or burning it to the ground. But honest. Doesn't make a whole lot of difference to me either way. <laughs> and yes, you know it once again. A nation once again. And Ireland long a province be a nation once again. I don't care what they say. The butcher's a fucking teddy bear. Sweetest guy you'll ever. Glad to see the class. Here's your car, boss. Appreciate it.
Molotov, go out! Get behind some. I got a bead on him from the side. In my sights, motherfucker! In the last one, he died. Kill for him. Go, motherfuckers, die for it, daddy. Home, cocksucker. Kicked off the wrong weapon. I'm in Point Badon, and I need a new set of wheels. All that lot. Just getting her warmed up. Four wheels and an engine. You're set. Appreciate it.
I get a new vehicle out in River Road. One car is promised. Appreciate it. Get lost, Mr. Black Guy. Don't want to see you around here again. And fuck, Bark! You talk too much. Uh, Thomas Burke he came to the States as a boy uh, when his father fled Ireland, likely because of his involvement in the Irish Civil War. Um, after his father died of a heart attack, uh, Burke started running booze to support himself. I mean, he turned bootlegging into an entire industry, and Sal Marcano took notice. Uh, Burke worked his way up the ranks, but could never be made because he wasn't Italian. 